everyone, so in this video, I'm going to be pulling this OM606 out of a Mercedes E300 sedan. I'm going to be cleaning it up, slapping on some goodies from Diesel Pump UK and the Kangaroos team, and getting it ready to put into my 1997 single cab short bed Toyota Tacoma. So let's rewind a few months to when I pulled this engine out of its car. Now that I am done cleaning up the engine and painting everything, I'm going to move on to removing the glow plugs. As you can see, I already have three removed. Basically what I'm doing is putting a little bit of croil on the threads. I let that soak for a while. Then I take a propane torch for about 30 seconds. I heat around the glow plug. And then I am using a quarter inch electric impact. I have it on its lowest setting. So let's hope these last three come out and we can order some new plugs. Golf old trailer loaded down. How much oil you got in it? Ah. <laughs> So I finally got my custom injection pump from Diesel Pump UK and it's going to turn this OM606 from an EDC pump which takes a computer to run to a fully mechanical engine capable of 500 or more horsepower. The pump I went with has the 8.5 millimeter plungers which is the biggest one he has available. Stock these engines come with 5.5 millimeter plungers and they're very tuned down with this EDC pump. So first things first is I'm going to put the engine on top dead center then I'll pull off the old pump and we'll slip in the new OM603 injection pump then we can Hopefully fire this thing up and hear it scream. How quick that 
hit? Oh, that was amazing. <laughs> Look, it's moved like... <laughs> this is deadly, and it's so awesome. So I had an issue bolting the CD009 to the OM606. Basically, the new pivot ball that Diesel Pump UK supplied was about 3 eighths of an inch too long. So what I did was take the stock pivot ball, cut its threads off, then found an 8.8 .8 bolt with the same thread, and tigged it onto the base of the pivot ball. So now I'll screw it into the transmission and see if we got the right length. So thank you guys so much for watching this first video of the build series. We got the engine pulled out of the sedan, got all of its performance parts like the injection pump from Diesel Pump UK, as well as his adapter kit, and the kangaroo's manifold to get this HX35 spooling. Stay tuned for the next video where I put a Ford 8.8 .8 rear end underneath the Tacoma, as well as pull its 2.4 liter straight 4 engine and fit the OM606 and Nissan CD009 into the little truck. So like always, I'll catch you guys on the next one.